Okay guys, so in this video I'm going to show you the next module that I've added to Cron and this time I've added a questions module. So let's get into it. Now basically the idea here is that pretty much at uh, every on every Sunday I want to run this job which I call questions. And basically uh, my idea here was that all right there's tons and tons of people who are asking questions on different forums and trying to like get you know they they need information on programming things right and i thought i mean i don't have the energy to go through all of these questions so uh, or rather i mean it's useful for me to have a central place where i can uh, kind of grab all these questions and so i thought let's start off by just going to something like quora digest grab the questions that people are asking on these different topics uh, reduce that down to just a big list of different questions and then i can get an email every well every sunday basically so that the following monday when i need to start making my own videos i can either pick from my my own topics that i've picked or i can pick from the things that people are actually asking on my little channel here or i can pick one of the many 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 questions that come from various people uh, people on the internet so basically the way that it works is Here's my little application and all I've done here is that I have added this questions endpoint and that's going to call my question service which is going to grab all my questions and then I'm going to join that because what's going to be returned is an array so I'm going to join that with just a, make a straight, long long string which is delimited by a new line and then I'm going to send myself a message or an email and that's about it really so if we look at my email here you can see here I just ran the job here and there's tons and tons and tons of questions from various people on the internet and basically the way that this is done is pretty much that I've added my new I have two new services one for Quora Digest and one which I call my question service so if you look at my question service all it does is this thing here so it takes it has a bunch of topics that I looked up myself like these are fairly common topics where a lot of people are posting different things and I thought all right I'll start off with that and then all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna map over all these topics and then I'm gonna call my Quora Digest service which has another question uh, method that is called get questions which takes a topic then I'm just going to wait for all of these promises to be resolved and then finally I'm going to, because I'm going to get back a two-dimensional array here, so I will use flatten, which is a small function that I wrote, that is just going to concatenate all of these arrays together to one flat array, and, flat array. and then I will find all of the unique questions, which basically is done this way, where I take a value, the index, and a reference to the array that I'm actually trading over, and I'm just going to do index off on that value and check if that is equal to that index. In other words, it's this should be like if the index of the value that I'm I'm currently on is the same as this index, I will simply return it, and then finally I will sort all of that, and that's pretty much what all of this is doing. So it's not it's just a this service is just a wrapper on top of multiple other services. In the future, it's very likely that I will get. Well, I will probably um, add more entry points to this, like or other more integrations where I might go to Stack Overflow and I might go to other services as well to just grab the data. And this then this service is just the interface that I'm consuming in my actual route handlers so that I can in an efficient way just grab all the, all the questions because I don't really care where the data is coming from. That's the responsibility of each of the integration services. This service is just responsible for making sure that I can actually get the questions that I want. So Cora Digest service is this thing here where basically we go to our Pal Puppet here again and we're simply going to log out the topic and we're going to start up a new headless browser and go to the topic section of Quora and then basically all we're going to do is that we're going to grab all of the questions that are on that page loop through all of them and, gra and grab the text content of those elements which is just going to be the text that is inside and then we convert the uh, corresponding JS handles that are returned from this get property method and we convert those into JSON values, which is just going to be text in this case. We close the browser and then we return the questions. And that's pretty much it. So now we have an automated way of uh, getting different programming questions. I hope you found this useful. Have a great day.